Hey everyone, Derek here from Addictive Tips. This video here, we will be talking about how to install apps on Ubuntu offline. So there are a couple ways to do this, but uh, in my experience, the best way to do it is with Cube. So to start off, check the description of this video and learn how to download Cube. Once you've downloaded it, open up your terminal and cd into the downloads directory and then into the Cube directory that you extracted. From here, you can just execute cube by doing dot slash cube. Now this is gonna start a local web server directly in another terminal. It'll open up a browser. So Cam Camry, uh, Chemicry Cube, I guess. Um, so let's start a new project. Project will be offline. Click create. From here, you can open your project now this will load everything up. Now sometimes the app may close on you, don't worry about that. If the app does close, and it may happen, I've had it happen occasionally, just reopen it with the same command. So from here you can search through the available packages. Now I'm gonna find a small app, let's go with Midori. Say I want the Midori browser. I can just search for that in here. Uh, let's try something else then. So here's the Chromium browser. So if I want to install this offline, I can click the download button. Now this is going to show me the three packages that it needs to run. Then I click the download button. This is going to download everything that I need. And it's downloading, it's downloading, it's downloading. It's going to take a bit. So with everything downloaded, and you can go through and you can find other apps, you can go ahead and close this or minimize it, open up your favorite file manager, and uh, look for the cube folder in your download directory. Now you could use the graphical user interface to install apps. In my opinion, that's not really the way to go. You should just go into projects and then look for your folder, your project folder. So the offline project folder is what we need, data, and then packages. Now if you look in here, here are all the offline packages and you can just copy these directly over. And you can also just copy the offline project folder entirely. And uh, let's paste it here. Now we're gonna pretend that this documents folder is a new computer. So I'm going to disconnect from the internet and you will see how this works. So let's turn that off. So now because all the dependencies are taken care of, all I need to do is go into the packages folder, open up a terminal, and uh, you can also execute it by going to the command that I have listed in the description, but you can also just right click, open a terminal direct directly here, and then do sudo dpkg-i, and then deb. Now this will install every single deb package in the folder. And because we have all the dependencies, it can install offline. So you can copy your project folder to a USB stick and uh, just go to any Ubuntu machine that needs this app that you want to install, and uh, it's that easy. And now, as you can see, we can launch Chromium. Even though we're offline, I'm not sure why you'd want to install a web browser <laughs> offline, uh, but it's possible, you know. Chromium sometimes needs to be installed for backend stuff, for like rendering in games and things. But as you can see, our app installed, even though we're not connected to the internet. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is how to install apps offline on Ubuntu. And I will see you guys in the next one.